so coming to the analytical method of uh, to find out the rms value so this is a red line is a current waveform where i is equal to im sin theta and i square is positive and the negative of cycle is converted into positive of cycle i am taking a, this small portion that is theta on y axis i am taking the current and x axis i am taking a time is in degrees so in the previous case i am taking in terms of total time period that is uh, t and that will be divided in terms of uh, seconds only t by n t by n equal intervals and now integrate this waveform with respect to d theta then i will get the total area of positive of cycle and i square is equal to im square sin theta and the area of square over a half cycle is equal to the limits are 0 to pi and this waveform now it is integration 0 to pi i square d theta the length of the base is uh, pi only if you want to calculate the average value of square of the current or half cycle is equal to area of square or half cycle divided by length of the base or half cycle what is the area of uh, uh, square over uh, half cycle is integration of 0 to pi i square d theta divided by pi so 1 by pi integration of 0 to pi i m square sin square theta into d theta sin square theta can be written as sin square theta can be written as 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2 so 1 minus cos 2 theta divided by 2 into d theta so this is i m square so i m square by pi 2 pi integration 0 to pi 1 minus cos 2 theta into d theta i m square divided by 2 pi integration of 1 d theta is theta minus uh, integration of cos 2 theta is sin 2 theta by 2 substitute here sin 2 theta by 2 the limits are 0 to pi if you substitute upper limit uh, this value is pi and lower limit anyway it is 0 yes upper limit is in sin 2 pi by 2 minus sin 0 this value is 0 sin 2 pi is 0 sin 0 is also 0 then this is i m square by 2 pi into pi so pi pi will be cancelled i m square divided by 2 so the average value average value or mean value of square of currents is equal to i m square by 2 and what is rms value so i rms is equal to root of this mean value of square of current so that should be equal to i m square by 2 so finally the answer is i m by root 2 and uh, IRMS is equal to IM by root 2. So final value IRMS is equal to 0 0.707 times of maximum value. Similarly, VRMS is equal to 0 0.707 times of V maximum. What are the importance of RMS value? What is the importance of RMS value? So generally the AC quantities are me measured in RMS value it is 11 kV, 33 kV and 66 or 132 or 220 kV. All the voltages are line to line and RMS values. A single phase voltage is 230 volts. So and uh, 
115 volts if it is a 230 volts by 115 volts transformer and these are also called as the RMS values and the AC ammeters ammeters and voltmeters which will measure the RMS values only finally the heat produced in an DC circuit is equal to heat produced in an AC circuit provided with the same time period and same resistance.